Hi, I'm Dave Dean, I'm staff writer at CDN. Um, today I'm here with Amar de uh, the new president of Lenovo North America. Amar, thanks for being here. Thank you for having me. And this is your first tour of Canada as the new president of Lenovo North America. What kinds of observations have you made about the Canadian market and um, what kinds of goals or challenges do you foresee? Yeah, well, uh, first of all, I love coming here. This is not my first time in Canada, but my first time as an executive of Lenovo, and I see mostly opportunity. Uh, we're doing well in the Canadian market, but there are plenty of pockets for growth. So we do extremely well in the large enterprise market. We're nearly one out of two large enterprises in this market that are sourcing Lenovo products. But overall, our market share in the PC segment is about 14%. And as you would know, worldwide we're at 20%. So we're under-indexed in the Canadian market, which spells out opportunity. In particular in the consumer segment, where uh, we're in single-digit market share now, and should be able to double or even triple our market share, uh, hopefully very quickly. Now, the Canadian channel um, doesn't know you very well yet. What would you tell them is your philosophy to the channel? Well, the number one philosophy that we've built the company on is we are totally dedicated to the channel. So that usually works well. We try to make very simple programs that we roll out that we have now unified and integrated with the server business. So it's one size fits all, if you will. It's one simple program. And we channel, no pun intended, most of the business through the business partners. With Windows Server 2003 support uh, ending, as well as Windows 10 uh, being released just around the corner, are there any updates to um, Lenovo's uh, server and PC strategies? Well, we have now totally merged the product families that we had with Lenovo on the server side called the Think Server and the x86 product family. And now we run a very comprehensive and complete series of products ranging from the uh, rack and power devices to, of course, the converged systems and densities and blades. So with that, we're very well positioned to attack the market. Yes, some of it you know, uh, may uh, see a little bit of growth because of, uh, of uh, the Windows uh, uh, server that you alluded to. And as for Windows 10, we're also quite excited because uh, in most times in this industry that uh, Windows had a new release, it has spurred an interest in the products and uh, an opportunity to renew those products. And we think that the early reports that we have seen and, and read about uh, uh, on Windows 10 are very promising. Do you have any unique approaches to the French-speaking Quebec market? Well, one in Rome. You know, uh, uh, do as Romans do, and uh, hopefully one in Quebec. I hope to be able to get there soon and practice my native French, as you would know, with a last name, last name like mine. <laughs> I was actually born and raised in France, and of course, you know, our products will be uh, uh, delivered and supported uh, in the French language. Well, there you have it. Um, Amar, thanks so much for joining me. Stay tuned for part two of my interview with Amar de Lancassin. I'm Davian for CDN. Thanks for watching.